my understanding is that this area was one of the worst in the Philadelphia area. And after this was built, it's probably one of the best. I guess the most fascinating thing about this is that this was a dream that was beginning to mold like you do a figure or a statue into a solid concept and idea. The co-op started um, um, maybe late 48, 49. The idea of, of um, interracial living, which was in the air and, and important to a lot of people, ourselves included. And um, I don't know, an openness of talking with people. We were buying our apartments, but there was no money required because we could do it all with sweat equity. And I had ne probably never heard that term before, but uh, that spoke to my condition in a big way. Sweat equity was the mechanism by which people that lived in this community that didn't have a lot of money could own their own apartments and the equity that they got was through their own work. And that was, economically was the wonderful thing.